Hello and welcome, this is Eagle Eye 621 and today I'm going to be showing you how to get a God Sword in Survival. Now do be aware that this is certainly unintended and in fact this has already been patched. The pre-releases have been coming out almost daily at this point, but if you have not kept up with them and you are still in pre-release 6 or 7, you are able to get this. And let me show you what I am talking about. And that is this sword right here. As you can see, has sharpness 3 on it, followed by knockback, followed by another sharpness 3. Then you have someone breaking a smite, which shouldn't be able to be put on a sword that already has sharpness. And then a third sharpness and a second smite. So this is a sword with multiple enchantments that should not be allowed to be on and also has multiple of the same type of enchantments that also should not be able to be on. And as I said, this glitch exists in Java 16 pre-release 6 and 7. And the way that you're going to get this is just grab yourself a looting 3 sword and run around in one of these bastions. And this, uh, they're very uncommon. So you might be running around for a while, but find somebody with some glowing armor and go and find it and kill anything you see with this armor. And it disappeared on me, which is not great. Um, so that's going to be an issue as well. You do need to get them to drop the armor. And you're also just going to have to kill anything that is taking up the mob cap in this general area as well. And just keep on roaming around and look for somebody that has something nice and shiny, potentially worth stealing. And keep on going. You will have to kill a lot of these guys because it is a very rare drop. I've probably killed... A couple hundred of them, uh, maybe almost a thousand, and you still get these maybe once. So it is going to be a pain, but it is worth getting. And I can show you why if we go up to the top or have something prepared. I'm playing around with this sword as well. Do note that you can also get this glitched armor on the gold armor itself and on some crossbows. That said, the gold armor is not really that great to begin with, even with the multiple enchantments, it won't last that long. And the crossbow doesn't really do much either. You can get some extra piercing in it, as I've seen some other sites and on the bug reports. Uh, but the issue with this type of armor is if I grab a mending book, and let me grab this for later, and I've just made some copies of the same thing is if you try and add anything to them, you'll see that the other enchantments do come off. Now, you do get to keep the smite and the sharpness, so this may be worth doing so that you can add the mending to it, but as you'll notice, the multiple copies of the different enchantments does go away. Now, if you do want to do this, you can use this sword continually, and it will have the smite 3 and the sharpness, but since you have sharp 5 and smite 5, this sword is not going to be all that good. Now these enchantments do actually stack, so it does make a difference. And if I put a zombified piglin in this cage and in this cage, you'll be able to see that if I grab this sword that I made that just has smite 5, and you can see that takes 1, and two shots to kill that. But if I move over to this god sword that has the multiple different types of enchantments and the stacked same type of enchantment, that is a one shot. And that is not a fluke that will happen every time, nor is, and I can always just put it in the same cage so you can see there's no funny business, the two shots of your normal smite five. So the sword is worth getting, but it's honestly going to be a little bit more of a showpiece for a museum than anything else. Same goes with the glitched armor and also the glitched crossbows. If you found this video helpful, I would appreciate a like. If you found it interesting, maybe even tell one of your friends. And for more videos like this, do be sure to subscribe. 
I have uh, two very interesting videos coming out back to back. I think most of you will really like. So be sure to stay tuned for those. Thanks for stopping by.